Hello everyone, welcome back to Lit Look. In this video, we are going to discuss Toro debts are cashier in a tree. Here goes the introduction and we are going to discuss this stanza summary along with the mind map, major themes of the poem, subtitle suggestions for writing your essay and the study questions for your exam preparation. Introduction. Kasharana Tree is a poignant and evocative poem by Toro Dutt, a prominent Indian poet of the 19th century. Dutt's intricate descriptions and heartfelt reflections invite readers to contemplate the tree's profound symbolism and its connection to the themes of love, loss, and nostalgia. With its lyrical language and powerful imagery, Kasharana Tree reminds a timeless tribute to nature's splendor and the fleeting nature of human existence. Let's go with the mind map. Stanza one begins with a vivid description of the Kasherina tree, standing tall and majestic against the sky. First stanza talks about the majestic appearance of the Kasherina tree. Also, the tree is portrayed as the symbol of strength and beauty in nature. Let's move on to the second stanza. The speaker here recalls how in their childhood, they used to play under the shade of the Kasherina tree. As we all having the uh, childhood memories, the memory of those carefree days fills them with nostalgia. Second stanza, it talks about the poet's nostalgic experience memories. The tree serves as a backdrop of the speaker's fond of recollecting the youth. Third stanza, the speaker reminisces about the joyous moments spent with friends under the Kasherina tree, also recalls the laughter, games and songs shared in the tree's shelter. Stanza 3, it serves as a, the tree serves as the timeless symbol of stability and constancy. Coming to stanza 4, as the day fades into night, the scene under the Kasherina tree transforms like how uh, during the daytime they, they were playing and they played so many games and they had fun. But during the night, the speaker describes the tranquil atmosphere of the moonlight filters through the branches. Even in the night time, the poet was enjoyed under the tree. Stanza 5. The speaker reflects on the passing of time and the changes that have occurred since their childhood. They lament the loss of innocence and the transient nature of life. Finally, the last stanza, it is the significance of the Kasherina tree. Also, the poet cherished the childhood memories. Also, the speaker's desire to recapture the innocence and happiness of the childhood. Coming to the major themes of our Kasherina tree, Nature and memory, memory and nostalgia, loss and grief, beauty and imagination, cultural identity, cycle of life and death, roots of reflections. These are the major themes in the poem. Next, the subtitle suggestions for your essay, where the subtitles directly connected with the entire summary and this will help you to remember the uh, important points of the essay. Nature and transcends memory and nostalgia, roots of reflection beyond the bows, cultural identity, beauty and sublimity, whispers of time, immortality and cycle of life and death. Overall, the Kasherina tree by Toru Dutt explores the themes of nostalgia, friendship, the passage of time and the enduring power of memory through vivid imagery and heartfelt reminiscences that invites readers to reflect on the beauty and transcends of life. Here goes the study questions for your exam preparation. Nature and memory, laws and longing and time and transcends. These are the major themes which we can expect the questions. 
in that part. So here I have uh, uh, mentioned the natural world. How does that depict the natural world? And all about the memory and nostalgia. The entire poem talks about the memory of the speaker and nostalgic memories of the speaker. Also the loss and longing. How the speaker has uh, experienced the past memories and passage of time and transients. Also the question we can expect under cultural and colonial con context, also the language and form, cultural background and colonial or post-colonial perspective, also the use of language, the poet's use of language. So these are the possible questions uh, in connection to the discussions. This will be helpful to you while preparing for your uh, semester exam or internals. If you have any questions, you can uh, give your questions in the comment box that will be discussed in a separate video. Thank you for listening.